this is really a serious, serious situation that we need the people's help on. We literally need thousands of letters to pour in. First on three tonight, Lancaster officials are calling on residents to write to Sacramento in protest. Hello and thank you for joining us. I'm Lauren Lister. Hi everybody and welcome. I'm Bob Montague. Officials say that this effort could be the only recourse to stop nearly 1,000 high-risk prison inmates from coming here to the Antelope Valley. The California Department of Corrections reports they plan to move forward with bringing more long-term inmates to the prison in Lancaster beginning in May. This despite opposition from local government. Lancaster officials claim one important factor in the city's decreasing crime rate has been that three years ago, three of the four prison yards here were converted to reception areas for prisoners going in or out of the system. They report the AV saw a decrease in relocations and visits associated with the prison. So an immediate impact in schools, in crime, in neighborhoods, almost an immediate impact. Uh, and the reason for that is because the families of the prisoners no longer moved up here. And the ones who were here moved, you know, we, we actually had a drop in attendance at the schools. Uh, and it became a more safe place to live. Well, now officials say the state's plans would change that. The Department of Corrections reports they plan to convert a reception yard to a regular prison yard for level four sensitive needs inmates. That means they are the highest level of offenders requiring the maximum security. These are special needs prisoners, i.e child molesters and prisoners of that type, those people will eventually be released at the bus station and asked to go wherever they're supposed to go. Half of them do, half of them stay here. Lancaster officials say the change would stand to bring more family and friends with these prisoners who often also include criminals and gang members. Corrections reports they are backed up with these inmates in the system and need the beds. For information in a sample letter opposing this change, you can visit the city's website at cityoflancasterca.org. Well, the Air Force's most expensive...